Interpol treated the problem of, of uh, medical product counterfeiting and pharmaceutical crime as an IP crime. And we had it under the same umbrella. And uh, we received criticism just time and time again that our operations were not being targeted to remove fake medicines or counterfeit medicines, but they were being used to target competitive producers of medicines that arguably had markings that were similar to um, protected medicines. So what Interpol has tried to do is we've pulled the issue of medical product counterfeiting and pharmaceutical crime out of the IP area, I'm sorry, and it's a standalone area now. Um, and the IP area, we sort of leave it to the, the, the institutions to battle it in a civil arena and not in a criminal arena as far as Interpol is concerned. But it's, it's you know, it's reasonable minds could differ. I'm sure here you guys really, really could differ. But uh, that's the way we approach it.